So I'm cleaning at my kitchen, doing like spring cleaning, even though it's almost summer. And I've had this for so many years and I use a lot of spices, but I think I want to get a new one. So I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to take this, wash it, clean all of these spices out of it. And then I'm going to go ahead and make it into something for my classroom. So I'm going to repurpose this spice rack. I'm just going to go ahead and start taking these out. Um, I have had these for so many years, at, but I don't use all the spices. I only use certain ones. So, I'm going to go ahead and start taking these out and cleaning it. Okay, last bottle. Okay, so now I have the lids and the jars that I need to clean. And then I need to repaint this. I think I'm going to let them soak in some soapy water for a few hours because they're kind of hard to clean. They're harder than I thought they would be. So now I'm going to let the top and then the few extra bottles that I had left over that wouldn't fit, I'm going to let them soak, soak in this soapy water. <laughs> say black so I'm going to cover them with tin foil so that I don't paint them. Bright duct tape. All these duct tape colors I'm going to put them on the jars. This is what it looks like now. So I painted it. It's really pretty and the spice rack jars like i just put different kinds of duct tape this one i messed up on i need to redo it but i bought all these pretty colors of duct tape and put them around the jars you can either put labels like on the jars or you can put them here on the circle that's what i'm gonna do i'm gonna make labels i'm not sure exactly how many i need yet but i'm gonna make some round labels to put here and make them really cute with whatever I'm going to put inside. So this is just another way to organize our teacher materials. Um, I do have a teacher toolbox, as you can see over there. I have my teacher toolbox right there. That sits near my desk. This is going to be near my guided reading, guided math table. So this will be just in case if I'm walking around the room and I need something. This will be so much better for storage. You can do it either. <laughs> I like it different ways. Like, I don't like it all pitched in the same level. I like it to be kind of abstract, and my husband doesn't like that, but I do. So, uh, there's one I forgot to put in right here. But it's really cute. It was super easy to spray paint, let it dry, put the duct tape on. I will give you some hints. Now, when you use the duct tape, you have to be careful and not use too much. You don't need to overlap. If you overlap, it's not going to fit because this is really tight. If it happens to not fit, then you can use some Crisco or any other type of oil or grease and grease it up really well and then it'll fit right in there. So this is my teacher spice rack organizer. It's really cute. Thank you so much for watching my channel. If you like this channel and this video, please like, share, and subscribe to get future videos.